I prefer the litter that, you know, that it's odor control, you know. <laughs> You gotta make sure the, the prairie isn't too smelly, right? <laughs> That's right. That's right. So if you look at our sign right there, you can see that we're not too sophisticated. We misspelled progress and had to insert the R up underneath of it. So hopefully that'll that'll be a good sign for anybody that's thinking about uh, putting in a prairie. You don't have to be too sophisticated, you know, just uh, uh, develop a plan and uh, and put her in. More than one-fourth of Missouri, or about 12 million acres, was once prairie. Today, less than 1%, or about 18,000 acres, is prairie. We're members of the Mississippi Hills chapter of Missouri Master Naturalist. Our goal is seven prairies a year for seven years. We're finding out that this 8,000-year-old prairie was extremely well-balanced. This prairie does a bunch of things. Uh, it helps us with our erosion control. It helps build up the soil. And we're finding out that this prairie thing is so big on the brown bird crisis. And we're also finding out with our beneficial insects that we might be using a little less insecticide. And who knows what we might be saving that we don't even know about yet. I'm part of the Mississippi Hills Master Naturalist Chapter. We have about 50 members of all various backgrounds. Some have land and farms, and a lot of our members are working on restoring some of their areas, improving their habitat. Seems to me like there is a big trend and people are becoming more aware of the natural world and the environment and that habitat improvement. And I really think that people want to do something to help that. And of course, a lot of people like to see birds, they like to see deer, like to see other animals. So if they can provide a little habitat for that, I think they get a lot of enjoyment for that. And farmers can still have their fields if they want to put just even a 12 foot strip of prairie in between their fields, it can help so much with erosion. The, the prairie plants have the deep roots, and if they use that, they can conserve their soil. Soil is something that we really kind of take for granted, but that's one of the biggest crises that we're gonna be facing, not only water quality, but also the quality of our soil. And that prairies, they found out of an acre of prairie, um, can sequester more carbon than an acre of forest. So we need both, but we also have to realize that we have very few prairies left, and so this prairie restoration is just critical for um, the future of environment. Mm -hmm.